What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 21-22 Panini Mosaic Soccer, which is Premier League Soccer. Three box break, random teams number five just sold out. And again, guys, we're giving away 10 Father's Day packs. At the end of the break, we'll take all the names, randomize them. The top name gets 10 Father's Day packs ship sealed to them. And of course, the 20 spot break, random teams are the list below. Just please know that not every team will have autograph chances, but you are supposed to get one autograph card per box, five base silvers, 15 mosaic parallels, and 20 inserts or insert parallels. And that's from Arsenal down to Wolves. So, I'll have this for later. And then, of course, we can do the break now. Roll it. It is a five and a six, 11 times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 5 6 11 Scott down to Richard 5 6 11 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 11 times, Newcastle down to Norwich. All right, so Scott, you have Newcastle. Kevin with Manchester United. Matthew uh, Despard with the Watford Club. Brian Bohorges with Brentford. Brian Heyman with Manchester City, Joe Andreessen with Burnley, Jack with Brighton, Jesse with Arsenal, Zach with Southampton, Jesse with Everton, Carlos with Chelsea, Bennett with Leicester, Scott with West Ham, Jesse with Ashton Villa, Richard with Tottenham, Ship My Cards with Leeds, Wolves with Bernhard, Jesse Liverpool, Carlos Crystal Palace, and Richard with Norwich. Now I don't know if you guys want to trade any soccer clubs, but uh, if not, we'll start the break. And uh, we could post one more of these. So I'm going to repost it back up to the website. I wish. I wish that would have been awesome. Suns, Pelicans for Nancy. Ted Lasso is a great show, man. I, I love that show so much. Oh, 
All right, then, guys. Trade window close. They should. That'd be awesome if there was a chance to come out with like a like a product, or at least insert their autographs or something in a like Premier League, uh, you know, product like mosaic or prism. I uh, I ended up buying a uh, uh, Danny Rojas um, jersey from like the Warner Brothers website. <laughs> Danny Rojas is one of my favorite characters too. Not right now, Rex. We sold out of all of our merch, and you know, honestly, we I think we need to be better with our merch, but we haven't really ordered much. I know we're currently ordering stuff for the national, but I think uh, honestly, we should we should uh, be selling merch and having more merch around because I feel like people would love to buy it. But like I said, that's not really up to me. But I I am gonna voice that though. You know, just to have like hats, shirts, t-shirts again. You know. But right now we just don't really have any. We sold everything out. All right, good luck, guys. Hold on, guys. Let me change this channel. I don't know why I'm still watching the news. First box, guys. Good luck. La Conga, silver. Arsenal. Wow. Look at that. Case hit. How about a glass of Saka for Arsenal? I did not expect that. Jesse, Lost by Mojo. There you go. These are just loose boxes, too, so. Very, very nice. Not bad at all. Ben Foster. Motor. Redemption. Skip. Sergeant. Rodri. Martinelli. Should have at least one numbered card usually. And Jack Grealish, blue. For Manchester City, which is Brian. Number two ninety nine. All right, let's see who this redemption is. Premier League autographs mosaic card number nineteen. 
Laporte. Americ Laporte. Let me see who that goes to. Manchester City, which is another one there for Brian. All right, so there you go. Well, we ended up getting a little glass case hit. A color and an autograph, not a bad personal, or would have been a bad, wouldn't have been a bad personal at all. <clears throat> all right, next box, guys. All right, here we go, guys. Rice, Antonio. Harry Kane. And Raul Jimenez autograph. There you go. And that's Wolverhampton. And uh, is that was that supposed to be Wolves? I'm assuming that's Wolves, right? Is that like for short? I assume so. Seems like that's their mascot. Cristiano Ronaldo, Man of Mastery. Son. Not two racks, but honestly, people would pay for the merch because they've always asked for it. Um, you know, so many people ask us, why don't we sell t-shirts? Or I want to buy a t-shirt, you know, I want to do this. But like I said, I, don't, I think that's just not really what we do here so much in the sense. So, I mean, obviously we're our case breaking and we do IG, we have the store. So I think a lot of things come before us 
sitting down and seeing what we want to potentially sell and and have as merch. But I think, like I said, we're ordering some for the national, and then hopefully, like I said, we could have some here for the near future. Like I said, I don't even think we have to give it away in breaks, though. <laughs> you know, people will just pay for it, and it's not like we would charge. Thirty forty dollars a shirt. I mean, whatever we buy it at, just add a couple bucks to it, and just you know, for the customers. But again, we did have a lot of shirts. We did have a lot of hats, a lot of box cutters, a lot of everything at one point. But it just was all sold out. We were selling it on Jaspies.com. We took a lot of it to the national. We made special national shirts. But yeah, it just kind of been a. A little bit on the downside there. Yeah, D-Lo. I'll be there. We should have two booths, if I remember correctly, like we did last in Chicago. We should have one in the Breaking Pavilion and then have one in the main show floor, too, as well. One of them will be for just buying and selling, having merch out, and the other one would just be for, like, the group breaking YouTube and Instagram personals. Sar. 